this man will be But the companion of fools will be destroyed Sing it again Hey everybody, welcome to another Wisdom Wednesday. Wisdom Wednesday, that's the series we're doing during the summer for our Kid Men uh, Middle of the Week devotion and teaching. So uh, we're going to get started on that again this evening. Remember that I will give you a keyword during the teaching, and if you email us that keyword at mpewson at hopeandlife.tv, we will send you cool prizes out of the treasure chest. So there's all kinds of different things here in the treasure chest, so send us that keyword that you hear during the teaching. So let's get right into our Wisdom Wednesday here today. And today we're going to look at Proverbs chapter 11. Proverbs chapter 11. Uh, I'm reading out of the New International Version, but if you have your Bible, you can open up and uh, follow along with me if you like. Is uh, I call the, what are you looking for, proverb. And it's in verse 27. He who seeks good finds goodwill, but evil comes to him who searches for it. Did you get that? He who seeks good finds goodwill, but he who looks around for evil, they're going to find evil. There's kind of two ways you can look at that. Number one is just, you know, if you're looking for good things in your life and you have a mindset of looking for positive good things, good things are going to come to you. If you're looking for the right things, right things are going to come to you, uh, um, whether that's friends or relationships or even the material things that we get. If we're looking for good things, good things will come to us. But if we're looking for evil, we will find evil. If you're looking to cause trouble, if you're looking to be mischievous, if you're looking to, to do things that are not line, not in, in alignment with God's Word, I guarantee you, you're going to find evil things to do, and evil will find you. Another way you can look at it is, is how do we look at other people? If we're looking for good in other people, we'll be able to find good in other people. Now, I'm not saying that everything that everybody does is good, but if we have a positive mindset and we choose to look at people and find good in them, We'll find good. That doesn't mean that, that we, we just ignore that, that maybe there's some wrong things in people's life because all of us do wrong things. There's, there's shortcomings that we all have. But if we look for good in other people, we're going to find good in other people. And the same thing, the opposite is true, the same thing. If we look for evil in other people, all we're going to see is the bad in other people. If we choose to just see the, the, all the wrong things that people do or the wrong things that people say, that's probably what we're going to see in other people. I heard a story as I finish up one time. There was a lady in a church. Uh, and, and she was known for just never saying anything bad about other people. You know, just even, even people that people would say, oh, you know so-and-so, and they're such a bad person, or this, that, and the other. And the lady, that she would never say anything bad about some uh, other people. Well, it kind of made some people mad that they could never uh, get this lady to say something bad about somebody. So they got together and they made a little little plan. They're like, ha, 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 we plan, let's just ask her about the devil and see what she has to say about the devil, because we know she's going to say bad stuff about the devil. So they get together and they go up to, to this lady and they say, so, uh, so what do you think about the devil? He's a pretty bad guy, huh? And the lady thought about it for just a minute. Remember, she's a real positive kind of person looking for the good in other people, and she thought about it. She said, well, you know, for being the devil, he does a pretty good job at what he does. How about that? I mean, she found something positive to say even about the devil. I'm not saying I've ever find this, anything good to say about the devil, but you understand, we, we will find what we look for in other people. Hope you have a great week. Don't forget to tune in Sunday morning for our Sunday morning uh, kids' ministry teaching and devotion. Hey, everybody, don't forget that July 12th, 9.30 a.m., we will be having an in-person parking lot service in the Grayson High School parking lot. That's for everybody. It's a family service, all ages. People will be able to sit in their cars with the air conditioning on if they want them, or they'll be able to sit you know, on a chair, a, a, you know, a lounge chair or something like that out in the parking lot. But we don't want you to miss that July 12th, 9.30 a.m. Hope to see you there. Yay, in person! Man will be wise. He who walks with wise men will be wise. But the wise.